Hello again, thanks for your company. Tonight, mystery, drama and intrigue in Perth's television industry. A Perth TV identity has been sacked after accusations he'd pretended to be a hotshot from Hollywood who'd worked with the likes of Steven Spielberg and George Lucas. Here's Andrea Burns with a tale of two Davids, one from Perth, the other from San Francisco. Jurassic Park 2, The Lost World. Meet David Valentin. Uh, I did work on a, an, uh, a Southeast Asian film. Meet David Valentin. I, I fully understand it. It doesn't look good. This is a tale of two Davids. One's a hotshot movie man from Hollywood, Jurassic Park, E.T., Star Wars. Some of the directors on the films that I've, that I've worked on, that I'm credited on, include uh, well, George Lucas, Steven Spielberg, Clint Eastwood, Quentin Tarantino and Robert Rodriguez. But this David Valentin, well, he's just been dumped by a board of directors who reckoned that he made them think that he was that David. He was most proud of, of course, working with Spielberg and also with George Lucas on many, many films. So he bragged about it? Yes. Community TV company secretary Tibor Mansaris claims this David Valentin even produced a showreel of his work, work that included some of the biggest movies ever made. We will not condone a course of action that will lead us to war. He said he, he was a special effect coordinator, special effect producer, special effect supervisor, depends on which movie. The community TV board liked this David so much they gave him a seat, joining a powerful group of community leaders, including QCs and politicians. These references certainly helped convince them. A personal note from Steven Spielberg saying what a pleasure it had been to work with him, that he was saddened to hear of the loss of his wife. And George Lucas describing Mr Valentin as an invaluable asset to the company lauding him for being nominated for an Academy Award and also sending his sympathies for the tragic loss of his wife. And they say, OK, this guy realised after the death race in his life, I have to do something for the community. And community television is something which my, became my passion. Then there were the uni qualifications, honours in computer science from Perth's Curtin University, an electrical engineering course at Melbourne's RMIT, even an MBA from an American management course. But the company's secretary became suspicious. He was too good to believe. A check revealed Curtin and RMIT had never heard of him. And those cracker movies. Well, imagine Tibor Mansaris' surprise when he found this other David Valentin. Oh. <laughs> As you might expect, American David Valentin is furious. My reputation is intrinsically intertwined with my integrity, so it means quite a lot to me. Today, after a newspaper report, this David agreed to an interview. I've never ever said to them that this is the person I am. My accomplishments are something that I worked very, very hard for, and I'm consequently very, very proud of them. I'm sure that uh, a lot of other people have very famous namesakes as well. Did you ever lead them to believe that you were that person? I never led anybody to believe that. This David Valentin denies he ever said he worked on the blockbusters, denies making up qualifications. He said he never handed out bogus references. What are these references then that they claim that you delivered well, to I, them? As I said to you, from I George have not Lucas had access. And I, I don't know where these have come from. They claim you gave them to them. Did I? Well, I'm sorry, I've never given these to the, anyone. This David Valentin says Lucas Films has a policy of never giving personal references. And for the record, this David Valentin's wife didn't die. She left him. I'm sorry, I have not deceived anyone. I have not set out to deceive anyone deliberately. Peter Jeffrey, chairman of the Community TV board, confirmed they've voted this David Valentin off. We are squeaky clean, and uh, uh, that's probably the last we'll see of Mr Valentin. Meanwhile, this David Valentin hopes it is too. What I would like to see happen to this man is that he somehow has the ability to come up with his own accomplishments that he can be proud of. Have you ever worked with George Lucas, Steven Spielberg on any of these big movies? Not directly, no. I might have indirectly without my knowledge. At last we will reveal ourselves to the Jedi. At last we will have revenge. The Fraud Squad is investigating.